What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the current path spread for somebody. So let's see who's going to get this reading. Capricorn. What's up Cappy? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Capricorn as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. All right, Capricorn. So this is a path that I created to kind of hold us accountable for the stuff that we do and that we, the situations that we put ourselves in. <laughs> um, and it's always good to just look back and be like, okay, yeah, yeah, you know, maybe I'm not going to do stuff that way again. You know, it's a good learning um, curve, I feel like, for us. All right, so I'm going to basically ask what path you're on right now. What did you do to get to this path, the purpose of the path, and the result? And then I'll ask for some guidance slash advice towards the end. All right? All right, so Capricorn Spirit, what path are they on right now? Nine of Wands in reverse. Okay, so you're, I feel like you're working on, um, hold on, I want you guys to see the cards. I feel like you're working on releasing some boundaries. I feel like you have your guard up, but it's like, I feel like you have your, it's like one person made you do this and you could like be acting like this towards everybody. Um, so it's like, you're just like, well, I want to start putting my guard down because not everybody deserves that, you know? Um, kind of like you could be like pushing people away or you used to, and now you're like trying to, you're trying to be more open. Okay. Um, what did you do to get here? The world in reverse. I feel like you close out a cycle that has been open for you for a minute. Um, the world in reverse. The world in reverse does speak of cycles still being open, but I feel like you went. Maybe you went back to something that was open, and you did what you had to do there. But I feel like you closed something out. I do. Um, what's the purpose of this path? The three of pentacles for things to work together. For it, it's like. You want a har harmonious situation. Like teamwork makes a dream work, right? Okay. And the result of the path is the page of pentacles is a new opportunity being offered to you. I don't know if you're going to take this or not. I, I kind of, I really want to clarify yours. Um, so we're going to. Sometimes I clarify, sometimes I don't. But you got a new opportunity, so I want to clarify for you. All right, Spirit. What is this Nine of Wands in reverse? The Empress in reverse. Yeah, you're definitely not open at all. Not open for love. Not open to nobody. Like, don't talk to me. Stay away from me. Um, and I feel like that's, that's definitely the path that you're on is, is to open up. Okay, what is this um, the world in reverse? Eight of Wands. Yeah, I feel like you went towards something that wasn't closed off yet. That's that's how you got here. That's how you got to the point of where you need to um, be open. It's like you went back to something that wasn't closed yet. Okay, what is this Three of Pentacles? Five of Swords. But I feel like um, like this is the, this is the purpose of it is to work together so it can get you out of, out of your stressful energy, um, anxiety kind of. And it's like you it's like you had no choice but you had to do this. It's like you had to do this type of energy. What is this um, Page of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles in reverse? An offer is going to be made to you, but I don't feel like you're gonna take it because I feel like. I feel like, oh, this could be like, you're just like, listen, I want to be cordial. I want to whatever. And someone's like, but I want to love you. That's kind of what I'm getting. It's like, it's like someone's offering you something and you're just kind of like, uh, no, seven of cups in reverse. Yeah. Because you, you know, you know, you know, the, the, the realness of a situation. So just because, and I like this. It's like, it's like, I feel like you're going to remain open, even though something offer, um, uh, something, an offer is going to result out of this. I don't feel like you're going to take it. And I feel like it's good because it's like the universe wants, it's going to make you feel good. This is like you wanting to work with an ex or something like that. And, um, 
them and you're just like listen you know let's just work together to to make sure that we get this done because we got to get this done you know and then they're like oh yeah capricorn <laughs> oh capricorn you know and they're like come on you know let's be together and you're just like no bro like i we gotta get we, we got we gotta get these bills paid so I, so we can do this and we can do that and then we're gonna go our separate ways like that's kind of what i'm getting okay all right spirit any guidance or advice for Capricorn and this energy, this current path that they're on? My incense is not ashing where it needs to ash. Yeah, you're definitely, this is some guidance for you. More like confirmation for some of you. You're definitely in a cycle with this person. The cycle is now finito, okay? Uh, you have confidence here. I feel like you closing out this, this, this cycle is going to bring you some confidence. Didn't I say that earlier too? It's like you're going to feel really good or I, or I felt that one more card spirit oh hold on guys and you have listening here hold on I always like to read this it says darkness does not always equate to evil light does not always bring good so the universe wants you to pay attention more listen more with your body with with your intuition than what people are showing you because people are liars. Get into energy, um, meditate more, be in tune more with yourself so you can be more aware of people's energy. That's why I um, I meditate every day, Capricorn, and I also um, preach on my Instagram, which is in the description box below, a lot about intentional and energies and stuff like that. So um, I always tell people to spend some time alone. The more you are alone with yourself, with your um, intuition, you're able to kind of feel things and you're able to, um, it's just like, it, there's such an awareness that you get with that. Um, I also recently took a, a social media break, well, basically off of Instagram, I was still on um, Snapchat because I post on tarot, but I wasn't like looking at the stories or nothing like that. Um, it's also good to take a break, okay? Um, just it's, it's it's kind of just like anything in life. Everything in life needs a break. Why? Why? <laughs> Our brains are on twenty four seven, always thinking, always thinking. Bills, work, job, school, mom, dad, brother, sister, marriage, you know, whatever. And it's like it'll be nice if it. Obviously, it can't turn off, but you can sit yourself in an energy and make your, you know, and just like not think about anything, not do anything for just five minutes. Um, it'll definitely open you up. Um, I started really small. I started two years ago with my meditating. Like it was started like a minute and <laughs> long each, each session because I couldn't stay still, but eventually it went to longer time. So, um, you know, or just go outside, go for a walk, right? You are an earth sign. Um, I don't know why I feel like I have to talk to you guys today. Uh, you are earth sign. So er being outside with nature is very grounding. Um, you don't have to meditate. I know it's not for everybody, but there has to, you, you have to find a way to be one with yourself. That's for sure. Okay. Um, I'm only, I'm only preaching this because I've been in a situation like this before, um, about two years ago. Um, and it wasn't until I became present with myself, I realized I was in a cycle that I was doing you know, I would like it's like over and over and over again. So um, that's why I can kind of relate to that. Okay. All right, Capricorn, I hope this helped and all of that. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.